Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello, my name is Monica. Today I'm gonna be toning my hair um, and actually using rollers all over my head for the first time ever. So um, I'm gonna show you guys a really pretty blonde formula. My hair doesn't look that bad right now, but I do want to freshen it up. I haven't washed my hair in like two weeks, um, which is really gross. I've just been trying to like push it for this video. I'm actually going to see if I can swap this setup and see if it's a little better. Okay guys, so I just flip flopped the setup, so I feel like you can see it a little bit better. Um, just it's so, I feel like it looks like dull. It just needs a little sprucing up. So let's get into what we're gonna use. So I'm gonna be using Redken shades today. Um, I am licensed um, in hair, so I get them from a salon store. I'm sure you can get them from Amazon though. Um, I'm gonna be mixing three shades together today and I'm super excited. So these shades are my go-to. I have a 10N, an 8N, and a 10MB. I either use this formula or I'll use an 8GI, 9GI, and a 9N. Um, this is just the formula I'm gonna be using today and yeah, I'm really excited. So I actually don't have the processing solution that I normally use with the Redken shades. Um, it's like their processing solution. So I'm just going to be using Matrix 10 volume. I feel like it works pretty much the same. Um, I normally do this on damp hair. So I am going to damp my hair a tiny bit. Um, I never really do it dry. I don't know if you're really supposed to or... I don't know, I've just always done it wet. So I do wanna mention before I do dampen my hair that I section off my face frame. So like this amount of my hair. I still tone this part of my hair, but I leave the toner on way less time. So I put it on last um, because sometimes toner can make your hair look, I don't wanna say dull, but I actually like the effect of less toner in the front. I feel like it makes my hair look brighter. And I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I don't measure a thing. So I kind of just eyeball it. So, sorry. <laughs> so I'm gonna do, this is the 8N. I'll do like kind of half the bottle of 8N. And then I'm gonna do 10N. And then do, oops, a little bit of 10N. A little bit of 10 MB, just like that, just like a drop. Again, I'm really sorry, I just never measure anything. So, it's just how I roll. And then I'm taking the 10 volume, and I'm just kind of eyeballing it. I know like what kind of color it should kind of look like. So I kind of just do that. Perfect. <laughs> My best friend like yells at me because I don't measure anything, but it just works for me. Can't help it. So just shake this up. I'm going to dampen my hair and then section off those two pieces. I'm just gonna do it kind of with the sink. Just, just a little bit. And then like I said, I'm gonna leave out face frame I do put toner in my face frame but I just wait until the end I probably look literally crazy right now whatever okay perfect 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 so I'm just gonna start to apply this all over. I don't really section either because I feel like when my toner goes on my, um, goes on like towel dried hair or like damp hair, it just glides really easily. So I feel like I can like cover all the areas that I need to without doing like really, you know, small sections. But hey, if you wanna do the small sections, go for it. I just feel like it spreads so easily. And I have to say Redken Shades are probably my favorite product to tone with. I just feel like it's easy and um, 
I know that they don't last as long, but I actually like to tone my hair a lot because I don't know, it gives it like a fresh feeling. So, um, and I also do it from home, so it's not like a big deal. Again, just applying this, smoothing this through everything. And I also don't really go all the way up to my root. Um, if I was in the shower, I would just cause it's like easier, but my blonde doesn't come up that high in the back anymore. So I just kind of keep it where it has to be, but it, oh, it already looks so good. You can kind of see already. I don't like my hair super ashy. This formula is more of like a neutral kind of sandy beigey kind of blonde. I normally do something like a sandy beigey or more of like a golden. I like both on myself, I'm not gonna lie. Um, golden, I know a lot of people are scared of golden blondes. Um, golden blondes make you look brighter, makes your hair look lighter, makes your hair look brighter because it's reflecting off of the sun. Um, but sometimes I just like more of a neutral because I don't want it to be like super yellow. So yeah, this is looking good though. Just gonna let this process. What I'm gonna do is take down my face frame now. Dampen this. So I'm just applying onto the face frame now. And then I'm gonna let this sit for probably like five minutes on my face frame. All the toner. Okay, my hair <laughs> has all the toner in it. I'm gonna get my shower ready to go, but I wanted to share with you guys what shampoos I've been loving right now. Um, I just started to use the Redken Extreme Length, um, but I absolutely love the Redken Acidic Bonding Concentrate. I'm like basically done with them. Um, these are great if you dye your hair, if you bleach your hair. Um, it just makes your hair feel so like silky smooth and it's absolutely amazing. So I love Redken hair products. I think that they are amazing. So I'm going to shampoo. I'm going to shampoo my hair twice, um, condition, and then I'll be back. Hey, okay, I'm all showered. I shampooed twice and then I conditioned once with the Extreme Lengths. Um, by Redken and now I'm going to show you guys the products I put in my hair before I style um, So I'm first going to start out with this caviar anti-aging replenishing moisture leave-in conditioning milk um, This stuff is really really nice um, I like it a lot. It's super moisturizing Then for blow drying I'm going in with the design me power dry me spray um, this basically speeds up your um, blow dry and I think it really works. I have all my rollers set up. Um, I actually got my roller set from Amazon so I will link it down below. Um, it's great. It comes with, I don't even know how many rollers, but it comes with three different size rollers which are amazing. Um, and then it actually comes with these little clips that you can like clip them in. Um, the only thing is it doesn't come with a lot of clips so I had to take some of my other clips that I have like those and these little guys too just to clip the other ones because I know that I have a lot of hair so I feel like I may run out of it. So when I normally blow dry my hair I sometimes will put two rollers just in my front I'm gonna do my whole head today. Like, we're gonna try it out and see how it looks. I don't know if it's even gonna be good at all. I may look really crazy and I'm going out to dinner later today, so I hope that it like calms down if it is super crazy. Um, so, sorry I'm talking so much. I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna speed up the process. Um, I have a blow dry routine already on my channel, so I'm just gonna like speed it up so you guys can see. And then once I'm done, I'm gonna let it set for like 10 minutes, do my makeup, and then come back, and then take it out. So, let's get started. Guys, my hair feels so soft. After I do the red kind of shades, always, it just feels so good. Like I said, I have my blowout routine already on my channel, but I'm just gonna do like a quick kind of speed dry kind of situation. I'm just gonna fast forward everything because I have that video and it goes super, super in detail with everything and like how I like move my brush and like what blow dry I use and all that. So I will link that video down below also, but I'm so excited, let's get started.
I'm not gonna lie, I'm literally sweating. Like, this is so much work and they don't even look good at all. So, hopefully that doesn't affect anything. Okay, I'm finished. I am sweating. They look horrible. They look so messy, but I think it'll do the job. So I'm gonna go do my makeup and then I'll come back. Okay, let's take them out. I'm also filming a TikTok, so let's see. Oh my gosh, I'm nervous. Oh, it's a big clip. Okay, hold on. It looks so good so far. So cute. Ow, ow. I definitely recommend getting different clips than these like no bend clips. I feel like they kind of hurt. Oh my gosh, it looks so good so far. Yay! I like the clips that this set came with, just not the ones that I used. <laughs> not my clips. Oh my gosh, it's looking so good. Okay, here's the last one. <gasps> I'm nervous. Oh my god, it's gonna be so bouncy. <laughs> I love it. So this is the finished result. I'm literally obsessed with it. It is so bouncy and like healthy and shiny and I think everybody should try rollers because this was like a game changer. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys soon. Bye!